The exhibition that we've gone and show here at the moment is the Sir Alec Clegg and Sir Herbert Reed exhibition and represents the work and philosophy of these two significant people in the development of art education and the way that their thinking impacted upon the development of children's work in schools and how that philosophy informed changes in the curriculum in the 1950s, 1960s and beyond. Certainly during the period of Sir Alec Clegg's role as CEO for the West Riding of Yorkshire. Uh, but in recognition too of Herbert Reed's developmental work through education through art and other publications most of which are housed in the National Arts Education Archive here at the Yorkshire Sculpture Park. Alec Clegg's uh, connection with the West Riding is considerable because he was the Chief Education Officer for what was then the West Riding and in that particular role was instrumental in transforming provision in schools particularly in the arts, and was also instrumental in setting up Bretton Hall College in 1949 as a training establishment for teachers of art, music, dance and drama. And his influence extended beyond West Riding, both nationally and internationally. In what we have here, the work in the exhibition is a summary of much of what we hold in the archive and as such brings together in essence some of those key developments and the underlying philosophy that supports changes at that time. Hence the notion of a revolution revisited because their work and their thinking at the time was quite revolutionary and arguably still is.